Sometimes when you're on a camping trip and you're the cook, the mission is very, very simple. You need to feed a lot of people, feed them fast, and feed them something really, really good. So on today's episode of Camp Griddlemore, we are making baby breakfast sandwiches two different ways. So let's get camping and let's get cooking. It is literally a perfect day here at Camp Griddlemore, and we are hanging out in front of Sean the Camera Guy's pop-up camper, and we're getting hungry for a little bit of breakfast. So we've got two different types of baby breakfast sandwiches on the menu today. First, we're gonna do that classic sausage, egg, and cheddar with Mike's Hot Honey, and then we're gonna do a healthier version with turkey sausage, egg, feta, spinach, and maybe even a little slice of tomato. We're also gonna use those King's Hawaiian rolls again, which are so perfect for feeding kids at a campground, particularly if you're going off on a hike or something like that and you don't want a gigantic breakfast. We used these for the mini French toast bites about a month ago, and we're using them again today. Let's start out by opening up our 12 pack of the King's Hawaiian Rolls. We're only going to use nine of them, so let's break three of them off and you'll see why in a minute, and then let's cut them in half as evenly as we possibly can. We're going to use four to five eggs, a splash of milk, the Blackstone SPG seasoning, which is clutch for so many different things that we make on this show, and a little bit of the shredded sharp cheddar. Now let's open up our five pound propane tank and fire up the Blackstone to medium heat. I'm gonna stay on medium heat for this entire cook because it's very forgiving, I'm not in a rush here, and I don't wanna burn anything. We are gonna put our eight sausage patties up into the far right corner of this 20 inch Blackstone camping griddle. After that, we're gonna lay down the tops and bottoms of our nine Hawaiian rolls and get them toasted up really, really nicely. Then we're gonna pour our egg mix into the Blackstone omelet ring and we are using just about every inch of available real estate to make these nine breakfast sandwiches. Sean also pointed out that if you toasted up all of your rolls first, you could actually then go double omelet ring and go double the amount of the sausage patties and you would come out with 18 breakfast sandwiches in one quick cook that would probably take less than five minutes. Our King's Hawaiian rolls are toasted to perfection. So let's get them off of the griddle and put them over on our cutting board and leave them to the side for a second. We have a little bit of room to move our sausage onto the main part of the griddle and now it is time to have some fun and flip over our egg. It's a little bit challenging to do but it's actually fun to do as well. Just take your time and give it a solid confident flip. Now that we have flipped our egg over, let's put on four slices of sliced sharp cheddar and dome it with the Blackstone Collapsible Basting Dome, which is just an MVP accessory for Camp Griddlemore. And when that is ready, we are gonna put it right down onto our bread and then check and see if our sausage is done. Our sausage is looking perfect, so let's take it off the griddle, place it down onto the bread, and then spread that Mike's Hot Honey all over the place, even letting it overlap onto the sides of the cutting board so we can use it to dip later. And then let's cut these sandwiches up and taste them and enjoy. All right, let's dive in and take a bite of our classic sausage, egg, and cheddar on the Hawaiian rolls. I'm even gonna dip it in a little bit of that hot honey. That's why it's kind of nice to spread some of that hot honey around on the cutting board. And this thing is gonna be a real crowd pleaser at the campground. I love the way that the hot honey tastes right on top of that sausage. It's so sweet, it's so savory, it's so tasty. Just about everybody is gonna want one of these at the campground, but we're also gonna do a healthier version. So let's dive in and do the turkey sausage, feta, spinach, sriracha, and tomato version. For this one, we are gonna mix up four eggs with a splash of milk, and we're gonna put a generous amount of feta right into the egg mix, along with some chiffonaded spinach. We're gonna put that right onto the griddle top, get the sausages going, and toast the buns, just like last time, the same process, but then we're gonna put them together on the sandwiches with a slice of tomato and some sriracha on top. All right, let's dive in and taste one of these turkey sausage egg feta spinach sriracha and tomato breakfast sandwiches. Now to be quite honest with you, and you could probably tell by looking at me, I'm a sausage egg and cheddar guy, but my kids always ask for healthier alternatives because they're in wrestling and they're in sports right now. So they really like these, all right? Let me bite in and give you my honest review. This is really, really good. I mean, like I said, I love the sausage egg and cheddar better with the honey. This is really good. I'm, I'm not saying this is like a full on healthy breakfast sandwich, but it's certainly a healthier alternative. 
if you have somebody in your family that's trying to eat a little bit healthier. So let me know in the comments below which one of these baby breakfast sandwiches you would prefer. The sausage egg and cheddar with the Mike's Hot Honey or this slightly healthier version of the breakfast sandwich with the turkey sausage. I think they're both really, really good. Thank you so much for joining us for this week's episode of Camp Griddlemore, and we hope to see you next time at the campground. <laughs>